If you guys need FIFA 18 Ultimate Team Coins, go and check out x3game.com. Their link will be down in the description. Use code CAPGUN to get yourself a discount. You're right guys, it's Capcom Tom here and welcome to episode number 41 of Milan Manchester Madrid. The series in which we are trying to get the top rated version of every player from the two Milan teams, the two Manchester teams and the two Madrid teams. Things are going pretty well but first things first, we need to update the checklist, add the one to watch cards and also the uh, informs that came out on Wednesday. So the two informs that are getting added to the Madrid checklist are going to be Cruz 91 rated and also Juan Fran 85 rated. We've also got the one to watch um, Diego Costa. I've actually checked him off because we already bought his regular gold card um, and uh, we only need to have the highest rated of the card in the club. So if the one to watch is the same as the sort of like regular card, then I don't need to actually buy the one to watch. If he gets an inform, then we may need to think about buying the one to watch. Then we need to add to the Manchester checklist two transfer players and uh, the two one to watch cards in Laporte and my boy Alexis Sanchez. He got himself a goal for the club yesterday. Absolute electric scenes. Loving it. Let's go. Let's dive into the episode and see what's up. Now, in the last episode, I asked you guys what icons you wanted to see in this series. We had a huge discussion about it. If you missed it, go back and watch it in the last episode. There's also a chance for you to win 12,000 FIFA points just by getting involved and sharing your opinion. There is a link to this giveaway down in the description if you want to get involved. And of course, it does affect the series because whoever you choose is going to be the icons that are going to make it into the series because I'm not putting them all in because I'll never finish otherwise. Now some people are questioning whether I'll ever even be able to finish this series. I am kind of optimistic um, with this series and how I think it could go. Um, just to put it in perspective, Team of the Year Ronaldo is currently going for I think 4.5 million coins. He is the most expensive player in this series. Obviously there are a lot of other players that are in this series that we need to try and buy. But we currently have 1.7 million coins. The regular Ronaldo, which we will be selling to get that Team of the Year Ronaldo, is going for like 1.8 million coins. So that puts us on about 3.5 million coins. So we're only a million coins off getting the most expensive player. I know that sounds stupid, but... You know, we could get lucky in our Foot Champs rewards. I'm hoping to get a lot better at Foot Champs over the, the coming months because, let's face it, I can't stay the same forever. I can't, I'm not going to get worse. Well, I have got worse so far, but hopefully we're going to get better. Hopefully I am learning to play better and uh, we'll make that count later on. And then, obviously, if we get better packed, we've got a better chance of getting better players. I'm going to keep on trading. I'm going to keep on trying to snipe an icon. I want to get a whole load of coins in one go from sniping an icon. So that's going to be one of my primary focuses throughout the series and going forward. And also just keep on grinding the coins out as well with other sniping methods. Today is the day that I snipe an icon. Okay, so I didn't actually record anything. I thought I'd been recording this whole stream. Recorded none of it. Just managed to snipe an icon. I will put the clip in right now, but it's got copyright music on, which might be a problem. So apologies for that. Look at, look at this. <gasps> yes, let's go! Come on, boys and girls! He's done it! He's flipping done it! Come on! Yes! Icon snipe achieved! I was looking for that. I've been looking for it for weeks. Looking for it for weeks and we get it. Yes! So yeah, we got Van der Sar for 278k. We're going to be able to sell him for 480,000 coins. It is an absolute unbelievable snipe. I'm so happy. That's about 180k in the bag right there, I think. Okay, so let's list this up and get our coins back for it. That is going to be a big, big chunk of change. I love it. Okay, so after all the excitement of sniping that icon, we haven't actually managed to sell him yet, but we will be selling him very, very shortly. I've got a few more things to list up here. Uh, let's have a quick look at the price of Van der Sar. 472 is the cheapest I see right now. They have dropped just a little bit, but that's not too bad. We're still going to be making like 100 plus K on it. So is it that much of a problem? Um, we are going to be making a big signing, but I want to show you how I got very, very lucky. I got very, very lucky um, because if you remember, I tried to buy Croatians preempting the Team of the Year nominee squad builder challenge. Now when the Croatian one came out, I forgot to list up all my players. So I've got loads of Croatians stuck in it. But what you might notice is that one of them is actually in the marquee matchup. So we have this guy, Pejic, Pejic, Pejic. I'm not sure how to pronounce his name. Um, but we've got like 12 of them and uh, they're all going for 800 coins. So that's decent investing right there. We bought them for 150. We're going to list them up for 800 odd coins. Um, I'll show you those selling in a bit. But we've got our marquee matchups to do. Um, I'm going to wait until three 
to do the, like, open the packs, like on the Wednesday, it is Wednesday right now, because I want to see who's in Team of the Week, and whether this Team of the Week that's just coming up will be better than the one that we have already just had. Like, if the one that's coming up is worse, then I'll probably open the packs now. Right, okay, marquee matchups are here. First up, we've got the Mock and Glad back uh, Squad Builder Challenge. We've got some players that I'm also going to be sending to the club, but this is what it looks like. Pretty much just Bundesliga and a few other cards chucked in, and some of them are untradeable as well. Right, okay, and Rapid versus Austria, and I think this is where we're going to be making the bulk of our coins, because as you can see, we have an absolute stinking ton of the cards from uh, doing the bronze pack method, which is always good, and you can see there how I completed the squad just with open Bundesliga players and a couple of untradeable goals that I have in my club. And then finally we have Udinese versus Milan, and that is the team that we have gone with right there. Um, we're just going to have to su submit Antonelli, so I've written him down so I'll buy him back when he's not so expensive. And there you go, we get a prime gold players pack as well for this marquee matchup set, which is like really, really good for marquee matchups. Okay, so you may have noticed the huge mistake I just made in that marquee matchup set, and I actually submitted two Udinese players into the marquee matchups. They're going for 4k each. Face palm, face palm right there. That is so frustrating. But anyway, let's have a look through our trade pile. We've started shifting everything out of our club from the marquee matchups. Always a good time uh, to make some money. Uh, as you can see, we're on 1.544 million coins. There's the Van der Sar. Still hasn't sold. It's a little bit concerning for 469, but he will sell eventually. There's no way he can't not sell. Um, we should be well over 2 million coins when he does sell. But we're not going to get a chance to do that because we are about to make a big, big signing. I finally list up Sergi Roberto as well. We bought him for 14k. He is listed for 27k, so uh, almost doubling our coins on that one. But anyway, let's go make this absolutely enormous signing. That's right, guys. It is going to be Team of the Year Marcelo. Let's have a little look at how much he is currently going for. I think he's just over 900k. Let's have a look. Right, he's looking like about 920. 915 is the cheapest, but it's actually about to expire. I think I can snipe him for a lot cheaper than this. So I'm going to try and snipe this Marcelo and pick him up for a bargain price. Right, okay, guys, here we go. We found this Marcelo. As I saw, the lowest bin was about eight, 915, I think. This one I found. We put a fresh bid on it, 870. Hopefully, it's just going to go through. Fingers crossed, this is our first team of the year that we're going to be adding to the checklist. I don't see why someone would outbid me because no one, you can't make money on it. There's not enough, there's not enough margin to make any profit on it. So unless someone wants to use it, they're not going to outbid me here. Held to the, yeah, let's go. Let's flip and go. I'll take that. I'll take that any day of the week. Marcelo, team of the year for 870. Oh, this is a great moment. He's not fresh, but I don't I don't actually put any sort of like thought into whether the player's fresh or not. But look at that. He's got 50 assists and 40 goals in 119 games played. I wonder if a lot of people have been playing him up front as a striker and as a left winger and stuff. So there we go. We'll add him to club. It does sadly mean that on Marcelo, who has played 470 games for us, but only scored six goals, is going to be leaving us. He has got 18 assists, but... Like, the goals and the assist ratio on that Team of the Year one are just absolutely insane. So, we are going to have to say goodbye to him. We'll send him off to the trade pile. And we will now be adding him to the team. My club. Get that bad man in. Finally, we might have, a like, a left-back that's actually going to do work for us. Because so far, up until this point, we have really struggled with the left-back position. Um, the normal Marcelo does let a lot of runs go. And it just really triggers me. So... Fingers crossed, I beg this card does the business for us. I beg it does the business for us. And it does mean that we can update the checklist as well. So there you go, Team of the Year Marcelo. The highest rated version of Marcelo there will be on the entire FIFA. And probably the highest rated left back on the entire game. Has now been added to the checklist and we are all good. I know it was complete done luck, but I'm so glad I bought all these Croatian left backs for 150 coins each ages ago and kept them. I could have easily just discarded them a long time ago. But anyway, um... It, I know it seems harsh, but I've got to say goodbye and good riddance to this card. God, he chilted me so many times with his non-tracking mentality. Oh, so frustrating. If the new one doesn't defend better, I'm going to be so upset. I'm going to be so upset. Anyway, we're going to lose a little bit of coin on him, but, you know, we got 400 or games out of him, so no problem at all. Right, let's, let's just get, let's dump off this Van der Sar. They seem to be crashing the icons. Van der Sar is sold. 
There it is. So we bought him for, how much did we buy him for? Look, Marcelo sold, Roberto, Sergio Roberto also sold. Mar Van der Sar sold for 4.59. We bought him for, how much did you buy him for? 2.79. So you know what, I'll take 160k on him. 100% any day of the week. Thank you very much. And uh, yeah, we're up to 1.195 million coins again. What day to be alive. What day to be alive, guys. Hell yeah. Right, so I just had a look at the new team of the week. Not going to lie, it looks pretty bad. Um, you'll have already seen which players were added to the checklist. Of course, it's Cruz and uh, Juan Fran are the only two players for the series. Don't look like they're particularly good cards, to be honest, or really all that usable. Maybe Juan Fran is, but other than that, not really. Right, okay, so uh, we're going to open the packs now, whilst the old team of the week is still in packs. So let's start getting involved. First pack. No. Nope. 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 Just store it. We've got a thousand coins in it though. That's something. Maybe we'll be able to use the players in squad builder challenges. Next pack. Another gold pack. This is what I got for uh, getting knocked out of that draft. Ooh, I thought I was getting boards. Ha! <laughs> Don't kid yourself, Tom. I'm relying on that prime gold pack. Okay, he's not that good because he's not in La Liga like I thought he was. This is the one. I think. Oh no, nothing. Okay. Nothing. Nothing. Nothing so far. But what is in the pack? We got Rolando. Yes! The legendary Rolando. We got Pep Guardiola, Pep Guardiola as well. I might be able to sell that. Jumbo Premium Gold Pack is nothing. Not even boards. Not even flares. Not even a rare player in it. So far, we have definitely lost money on the marquee matchups because we could have sold those two uh, Unese players for 8k between them. And we've had nothing over about 700 or 800 coins so far. We get Mangala. Not good. Prime gold players pack until last. Prime Electrum players pack. Come on. Give us something good for the series. No boards. <laughs> Martial, Jesus, Sané, something like that. No, nope, Adler. This game knows how to bring me to tears sometimes. This guy sells for like 850 coins. This guy might sell. I don't know, that guy might sell. <laughs> that guy might sell. I don't know, I don't think any of them really sell, to be honest. Right, okay, what's in the last pack? <laughs> what's in the last pack, please? Give me boards or something, I beg! There's gotta be something in this pack for me. All right, it's got boards, it's a miracle. What is it? Please be a walkout. Spanish, left mid, Vitolo. Oh my god. <laughs> Is this some sort of sick joke? <laughs> what is that pack? This guy's going for a thousand, but honestly, what? What am I supposed to do with all this trash? Oh god, I lost money on marquee matchups, which is almost impossible to do. I mean, I made money because I sold everything in my club, but still, lost money in overall from the packs, didn't I? Is that a 45k pack, the Prime Gold Players pack? Prime Gold Players pack is 45k and I got Vitolo. What? Right, okay, so we did a bit of sniping for the marquee matchups. Just sort of like staying away from the actual teams because the teams get focused very hard by the other snipers. and makes it very difficult to pick up cards. Um, so instead of doing the obvious, which would be to go for, for example... Udinese players who are all going for 4k plus I targeted the Italian uh, Midfielders because they are also selling there is also a lot of coins out there for them um, because You know everyone needs Italians to put into that team to submit so they've all gone up and they're not getting focused as hard And there's more of them so they pop up more so you can see like I was buying them for 800 and less And I got like absolute stacks of them so we're up to 1.225 million coins. Let's just look how many pages of, I was sniping for ages. God knows how I didn't get uh, banned quicker. Also a couple of other things like in there that, you know, I put that were already in my trade pile that just needed to be listed. But yeah, loads and loads and loads and loads of coins coming through there. And we still got a whole load of stuff to sell. So this should, I think we're on about 1.18, so 1,180,000 when we started sniping. And now we're up to... 1.225 so and there's still like another 20 items so there's another another 20k there as well so that's pretty flipping good wrong time zone for america australia but then you'd be getting home at like midnight 
players did not expect Edison or anyone to come up that we actually needed for the series and oh my lord Edison's come up for so cheap and he goes for 80,000 coins I don't think we're going to sell him I don't think we're going to sell him because you know we actually kind of need him for this series but what a snipe! Oh my god, that's like us. Like this, this episode is full of good snipes. So our best snipe before this was a guy that was a right back from La Liga. You might have remembered it from a little while ago, one of the episodes. Managed to get a right back from La Liga. He was going. We got him for 10k or something, or maybe 16. I don't know, something around that. And we sold him for like 30k. Today we've broken that record twice. I mean, we did we didn't break it twice because obviously our our first snipe in this episode was insane. It was for about 120k. Um, 150k, I don't even know, like, I don't know the numbers, you know what I'm saying, but Edison, that is a hell of a snipe, we're going to add it to the club, and you know what, we're going to update the checklist right now guys, I'm not going to sell it, I'm going to keep it, unless I get it into month tonight's monthly rewards, that card, I'll be keeping that, because that, whoo, I am absolutely hyped after that, I am absolutely hyped, I don't even know what to say, yes, let's get back to sniping some players, let's go, so there we go, here is the uh, checklist, we're updating it right now, what, this is unreal! This is unreal! Let's get him on there! Hell yes, another player for the checklist. Hey, 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 it's that time of the week for Champions Rewards. Uh, here we should be getting the monthlies, I believe, today as well. So, Foot Champions Weekend League complete. We get the gold one Foot Champions pack, which will contain six red cards. And we get the kit as well, which I believe we've already got. Um, oh, it's not six red cards. Five red cards. Foot Championship Weekend League. We got the two Jumbo Rare Players packs and the 50k. Now, I won't be opening the uh, Jumbo Rare Players pack, unfortunately, because I'm going to be saving them for Friday. So you'll see that in just a minute's time if you're watching the video. Um, but we will open our monthly pack because, hell, I want to open that right now and maybe we can get something good in it. Right, I just need to quickly show you what we've got in our trade pile. So lots and lots of stuff. Uh, a lot of that from the other day when we were sniping, sort of like, whatever. And then we got some Inform snipes as well. Mason, so we, we picked all of these up for under, under 11k. Um, and you saw the unbelievable snipe on the Edison, so that's really good. Uh, we can clear that. We've basically started investing in some Silver La Liga players because I believe they are supposed to be getting their squad builder challenge today. So that does put us on over 1.3 million coins. Um, what I'm hoping for out of this is any player from Manchester United, Man City, Real Madrid, Atletico Madrid, which I don't know if there are any from it. Yeah, there is Juan Fran. Uh, Atletico Madrid, um, Milan and Inter. So any player from those clubs would be great. Scenes if I get Neymar and then I can't use him at all on this account because he's untradeable. But fingers crossed there's going to be something good for us. Let's just go. Fingers crossed. Please, Lord, give me something really good. Please. Please. I beg you. Brazil is going to be Neymar. Cam is Juliano, isn't it? Oh, I don't even know who it is. Taliska. 84 rated. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't, we're obviously not going to use him ever. Maybe we can submit into a squad builder challenge at some point. It's not anything all that good. And oh my God, you've got to be. What is this trash, dude? A whole month of foot champions for that. And I miss out. The worst thing is I missed out on Elite by two games. Two wins. It's all I needed. And I would add 12 of these instead of five. <sighs> disappointing. I'm not going to lie. Really disappointing. I'm so upset. Oh, damn it. Damn, damn. Oh, well. We'll just pick ourselves up. Dust ourselves, dust ourselves off. We could have got best dust. That would have been great. Dust ourselves off and we'll just move on. Okay, so it is a new month, and it is foot champions time. We're 0 and 40. Think of all the possibilities that await us, all the rage that could be incoming. Fingers crossed we're going to do good this month. Changed up the team a little bit, of course. We've got that team, Liam Marcelo, into our squad now. Uh, also, I've gone with Bale on 7 chem at the uh, centre mid position, because I keep changing to a formation with wingers, and I don't have enough players to play two up top. And then have wingers when Modric is on the pitch. So Modric is actually one of my super subs now. He does really good. I might need to actually change this slightly. And have another super sub as well. 
Okay, so we'll have uh, Jesus on the bench as well in case we need to go super attacking when we'll bring on Sane, uh, Sterling and Jesus, just pace whores really. I think it's time to get into this. Okay, and have a look at this. Uh, you can see now that Foot Champions has changed, so you get to choose your kit and it's your reverse kit. So I have changed the Man United and Real Madrid away kits because they, they're completely different colours. I don't want any kit clash at all in my kits. Okay, so first player of the day... And, uh, yeah, he's got, well, he's got, well, actually, no, they're all on full cam, aren't they? But some of the players I wouldn't say are first choices, especially Emre Chan at cam. Valencia with Ronaldo. Valencia crossing. Oh! He's in! How is that not offside? We've got the start we wanted. We're not behind. Let's go. Hell yes, let's go. Composed from Ronaldo there in the box to get that goal. Oh, 3-0. Simple 1-2. I think that might be a rage quit there as well. Okay, so there is the first win of the game. You can see the record has been updated and added to the screen over there. So, uh, yeah. Let's see if we can build on this. Yes! Team of the year, Marcelo! Coming up big! Hell yeah, buddy! Here we go. Let's go. Okay, so I invested a load of coins into uh, La Liga players um, because we thought there was going to be a La Liga squad builder challenge and uh, it appears that there is not going to be one, which has kind of meant that I'm going to lose loads of coins. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and snipe an icon to make up for it. So here we go. Fingers crossed we get one. challenge i've got them all in the unsigned and using the unassigned uh glitch kind of thing not a glitch but unassigned exploit i guess you'd call it oh my god we <laughs> yes i don't even know what to say two in one episode i'm gonna keep on going might be able to get another one oh my good lord thank you lightning hours for giving traders like me a chance to get some flipping good players oh for cheap oh my god Okay, I've listed up Rykard for 487. That is the cheapest at the on the market by about 3k. Um, it's a really bad time to be listing because everyone's opening packs and no one really wants to buy players. If he doesn't sell this out, I'll probably list him overnight and get even more coins for him than the 487. But hell man, we're making a hell of profit any on him anyway. Like 180k, I will take that any day of the week. I reckon we can do this series, you know. I reckon we can do it. <gasps> oh my god, I've missed Bergkamp. Oh my lord, I think he might be expensive. Is that ba baby bird cam? Oh, okay, he goes for 475. I've just missed about 50, 50, 60k maybe on him. Oh, baby, that would have been another. Oh, oh Rykard's just sold as well. Let's go to the trade pile. Dear lord, I don't know what is going on. I've packed, like, in the last hour, I've s tried to snipe two icons. I've missed, sniped one of them, missed the other one, but we got the good one because this one was worth. Was so much cheaper and worth actual more than the uh, baby bird camp there. Um, so in the last hour, I managed and then and I managed to pack Ronaldo as well within this hour. I don't honestly, my mind is blown. I'm so confused as to what the hell is going on right now. Holy moly! Right, okay, Rykard sold. That's good. We're loving life, boys. I don't know if this video is not worth a thumbs up right now. I don't know what it is. Smash the thumbs up. Have you managed to get... Oh! No! No! I put the bid down. I've missed Clivert now. That's two in like three seconds. What's Cl baby Clivert worth? 487. It's another, it's another big one. It's another big one that I've missed. Oh, man! Okay, we got the first. We've missed two cents. Maybe there's going to be another chance for us. Maybe one more, ch one, one more chance, EA. One more chance. Oh! 
Oh my god! I got Ferdinand! I got Ferdinand for 105k! 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 I just bought on Ferdinand for 105k! What? What? No! No, I know that he is going for bank. I know right now. He, I already know he's going for absolutely loads. Where is he? Where is he? Wait, where is he? He's not appearing. He's lost in the flipping... He's lost in here. No! <laughs> he's lost. He's lost in amongst all of these stupid Lopez. He's lost! Where is he? Where are I gonna say? I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say. Uh, I'll go on Footbin. I'll have a look at what he's going for. He's 700,000! He's 700,000! He's 700,000! I've just sniped a player! I made 600k on a snipe! That! It's gotta be one of the snipes of the year. I, ca I can't say anything else. That is absolutely mad. So you saw it guys, you saw, you saw the Ferdinand, but we can't get him back because he's just not going to appear for us, which is an absolute nightmare. Um, but, 700k? <laughs> like, I don't know what, I don't know what to say. I honestly don't know what to say, this is out of control. This, I, I'm going back, I'm going back to try and snipe more because this is too good to miss up out. This is too good to miss, too good to miss. Right, okay, so the madness has sort of come to an end. Um, holy moly, like, <laughs> Ferdinand snipe. The Rijkaard snipe, the two misses, I packed Ronaldo as well, like, my heart is going like 10 to the dozen. Now there's this squad builder challenge, uh, the Alexi Sanchez one for the one to watchers. So we got from North London, uh, this is the squad we put together for this. Ramsey's actually selling, so we're going to pop him on the trade pile. Um, yeah, we'll just submit this and get a jumbo premium gold pack. We won't be able to open it straight away because we can't open packs while we have stuff in the um, unassigned items bit. So I have to wait for those players to sort of go up before I can really do anything. Um, and this is the one that we're going to be using for the uh, to Manchester. Uh, just basically went full Argentinian, Argentinian and chucked that together. Um, so yeah, we'll submit that. And there we go, some extra packs for us to open in a little bit. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's thinking about what, what screen he needs to capture. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Let's go. How much is this card? How much does this guy go for? Oh my lord. Let's go. 58,000. This is my day. This is my day. I have absolutely smashed it on the sniping front. I have smashed it on the sniping front. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, boys. Oh, another big snipe for the series. More coins in the bank. Let's go. New date, new foot champ run. We're going to see if we can beat this one. There's just no way. I love this game, dude. I mean, what is that? Hello. Dude, uh, what are my centre backs doing? They're not following any runs. Please go in. Yes, right. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You know when it's your day? You know when it's your day and everything falls to you and everything goes in? Yeah, well, I think we found a guy that's just having his day right now. Go on. Yes, let's go. Come on, boys. Oh, that's good. Yeah, 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 Let's go, boys. What a goal to get into the lead after being like 3 1 down. Composure here. 
Beautiful. That's a good ball. Oh, I had to... oh, let's go. And now all the luck's falling my way, kid. Let's go. So we start the day off with a win. Um, yeah, it wasn't it wasn't a fun game, but at least we've won it. That's all that really matters. So we got to seven and four. Let's go. Okay. Right, I managed to get myself a one to watch Edison for 70k. And you're probably thinking, oh, he's going to he's disappeared forever. Goodbye. Goodbye, one to watch Edison. But you're probably thinking, Tom. You've got his inform, but his inform, which we sniped the other day for 10k, is actually going for about 70k as well. So that means that we can sell his one to uh, his normal card and have the one to watch card, and then if he gets another inform, bang! We don't even need to buy the inform. We're just laughing. We are literally laughing. Okay, so there you go, guys. That is going to be the end of the episode. I know it was a bit like nuts. So much stuff happened. We must have made over a million coins or something like that um, from those icon snipes, the uh, Path to Glory snipe, the Edison snipe. We have like smashed it this week so very very happy i'm gonna leave the 100k packs from uh, foot champions until when i can actually open them because obviously my uh my sort of like unassigned pile is kind of screwed up at the moment i can't really uh, actually open packs until i clear it all uh, you can see there we trade or clear that out and we're still trying to sell edison if you have enjoyed this video make sure you smash it big thumbs up i will be letting you know um i believe maybe in the next episode what day is it um let's say I will give you until Wednesday to get involved in the 12k FIFA point giveaway which is going to decide the icons in the series and then I will let you know which icons will definitely be in the series in the next episode which will probably be around like Thursday, Friday sort of time. I'm not 100% sure but anyway, hope you've enjoyed the video. If you have, drop it a big thumbs up and I will see you next time. Peace!